Chapter 144, Fifth Level of Jidan Stage. That's right, these nine people were Kang Tion himself, completely carved out of the same mold as Kang Tion. No matter the size of their stature, or the strength of their cultivation, they were all the same. Except that their eyes were all incomparably cold, exuding a strong killing intent. Fighting against yourself, it's quite a good test. The corner of Kang Chon's mouth pulled up a smile. Boom. Without any unnecessary nonsense, the nine false Kang Chon instantly killed the true Kang Chon. And the terrifying battle completely erupted, even more intense than before. Boom, 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 boom. Suddenly, nine golden palms appeared in the sky, completely suppressing towards Kang Chon, the huge energy causing the heavens and earth to tremble. Kang Chion couldn't help but let out a cry of alarm. Nima, the nine false Kang Chion simultaneously executed their heaven escaping hands and suppressed towards Kang Tion. Everyone outside the arena couldn't help but stifle their laughter. They couldn't help but feel amused when they saw Kang Chion being abused by himself. This heavenly tribulation was just a marvelous. It could actually completely replicate Kang Tion himself, as well as the people Kang Tion had met. Even their strength could be replicated. Looking at the nine golden palms that were suppressing in the sky above his head, Kang Tion was somewhat in tears. This heavenly robbery was just a terrifying, even his master stroke, the heaven escaping hand. He really didn't know if he would even be able to do the heaven breaking stroke later on. It seemed to confirm Kang Tion's words, while the nine golden giant palms were suppressing down, nine brilliant blade-ons came across. Each blade-on was more than a hundred feet long and emitted a blazing light. Nima, this heavenly calamity was too bizarre. Kang Tion couldn't think of much. He instantly released his powerful true essence, building a layer of powerful defenses around his body to fend off the attacks of those nine fake. Kang Tion, rumble, with a violent and shocking sound, the defense that Kang Chion had constructed outside his body was immediately shattered by the nine golden palms, followed by the nine terrifying slashes that came to kill, ruthlessly slashing at Kang Chion's body. Plop! Kang Chion could not help but spray out a mouthful of blood. Although his fleshly body was incomparably powerful, but being hit by these nine blade-ons, he was also tragically hit and the five viscera and six bowels in his body suffered from not so light damage. Shit, how is this going to be a fight? Kang Chion endured the pain of his injuries and took a nine revolutions great restoration pill to recover from his injuries. At this time, the nine fake Kang Chion once again killed, each of them executing their hegemony fists, shocking and dominating punching intent turbulence in this heaven and earth terrifying energies rushing in like shocking waves in the ocean, instantly drowning Kang Chion. Kang Chion quickly recovered from his injuries and similarly performed the hegemony fist to fend off. However, his two fists could not defeat 18 hands. The other party had nine people, and he only had one. So naturally, he was no match, and was immediately beaten to the point that his head was broken and blood was spewing out of his mouth. This was completely one-sided abuse. Each of the nine fake Kang Chion was not much worse than Kang Chion. The nine people joined forces with unrivaled power. Kang Chion was beaten to the point of trembling and almost collapsing. The crowd outside the arena also looked at this scene in shock. These nine false Kang Chion were too powerful. Whatever stances Kang Chion knew they knew, restraining Kang Chion completely to death. In fact, Everyone's most powerful opponent is always themselves. This heavenly havoc has obviously grasped this point and copied nine opponents that are exactly the same as Kang Tion. King Zhenan said in a deep voice, Chiona will be fine, right? Wong Tixiong was worried, watching Kang Tion spitting blood every time he was beaten. His heart was clenched, but there was no way for him to help Kang Tion. The heavenly tribulation had to be crossed by himself. He could only secretly pray. Jin Sanxiao and others on the side were also very worried. 
but Jin San Xiao still saw a little advantage in Kang Chan and said, Elder Wong, you don't have to worry. Look at Kang Chan, every time he took one of those pills, his body was mostly healed, and even his true essence was all restored. He will definitely be able to make it through. Jin San Xiao saw that Kang Chan had taken quite a lot of Nine Revolutions, Great Restoration Pill, and guessed that this pill should have been refined from the herbs that Kang Chan had asked him to acquire some days ago. Wong Tixiong nodded at his words, his heart sighed in relief. He had also found out about this situation. He hadn't thought that Kang Chan still had this kind of potent and powerful elixir. It seemed that his grandson had had quite a lot of strange encounters over the years. The heavenly calamity also has a time limit. As time passes, the energy of these fake Kangshan will also decrease. As long as Kangshan lasts until that time, this heavenly calamity will not break. Lei Yun also comforted Wang Tixiong from the sidelines. The crowd all stared intently at the battle in front of them. Kang Chon battling Kang Chon. Such a scene felt strange, but had another strange splendor to it. People realized that the heaven escaping hand was truly invincible. Even Kang Chon himself could not resist it. Although he could similarly execute the heaven escaping hand to restrain the fake Kang Chon, he himself would be immediately restrained, and the two sides could only end up in the same place. This battle came to an end, just as Lei Yun expected. Kang Chon was completely following the stalling tactics used before, waiting for the heavenly tribulation to end. After all, the power of the heavenly tribulation was limited. It could not take pills to recover. Kang Tian himself, on the other hand, could use the Nine Revolutions Great Restoration Pill to recover. When Kang Tian took the last of the Nine Revolutions Great Restoring Dan, the battle had reached its final moments. At this time, Kang Tian, who had recovered his entire body's true essence, was already able to fight with the Nine False Kangshans, who had consumed a lot of their true essence, and both sides couldn't do anything to stop anyone. Fighting so stalemate down, the last nine false Kang Chon finally consumed all the energy, dissipated in the world, and Kang Chon himself also collapsed on the ground, breathing heavily, he felt exhausted. This heavenly tribulation was too difficult. However, in the end, Kang Chon finally made it through, he had officially become a Jidan stage powerhouse. Boom! At this time, a golden beam of light descended from the sky. Enveloping Kang Chon within it, Kang Chon didn't dodge because he didn't feel any killing chance. This beam of light contained pure energy, which was a gift given by the heavenly Tao to the person who had passed through the heavenly tribulation after the tribulation. Who you? So refreshing, the true essence in his body is rapidly growing. Kang Chon absorbed this pure energy with all his might. The depletion in his body was instantly replenished and it continued to grow. At this moment, his cultivation began to grow rapidly from the early fourth level of the Jidan stage and immediately reached the middle fourth level, late fourth level. In the end, Kang Chon's cultivation stopped at the fifth level of the Jidan stage realm before the golden beam of light enveloping him slowly dissipated. Fifth level of the Jidan stage, what a powerful force, now in this young generation of the great Tang cultivation world, who else is my opponent? Kang Chon stood up, his entire body exuding an invincible and domineering aura. His cold and arrogant gaze swept towards the crowd in the distance, finally resting on Zhao Wuji. At the same time, a radiant light erupted within Zhao Wuji's gaze, and his sharp eyes brushed towards Kang Chon. The eyes of the two young supreme powerhouses met in the sky, erupting with intense battle intent. What a powerful force! The surrounding crowd moved. At this moment, whether it was Kang Chan or Zhao Wuji, a shocking aura erupted from them. Kang Chan's domineering eyes caused everyone to look at them in fear, and each and every one of them shuddered when they came into contact with Kang Chan's eyes. Zhao Wuji, on the other hand, was like a golden god of war. The innate and shocking battle intent shook people's hearts. This youth seemed to be someone who was specifically born for war. 
A strong battle intense surged in Kang Chion's heart. In this great Tang cultivation world, this Zhao Wuji was the only one he was unsure of dealing with. The other party's strength seemed unfathomable. So strong, at least at the seventh level of the Jiden stage. Now, if we were to fight, although I'm not afraid, I may not be able to win. Kang Chan sighed in his heart. Zhao Wuji's strength was too strong. He did not have absolute certainty of defeating Zhao Wuji right now. After all, there was a big difference between the seventh level of the Jiden stage and the fifth level of the Jiden stage. If the other party was at the sixth level of the Jiden stage, he still had the certainty of defeating them. But the seventh level of the Jiden stage was a completely different realm, and there was too much of a gap between them. Raw, right at this moment, a domineering figure ran towards Kang Chon, his powerful aura shaking the heavens and the earth. Kang Chon's eyes narrowed as he looked towards the incoming person, who was none other than Li Yuanba. Kang Chon, today you will definitely die. Li Yuanba came killing with a spirit weapon grade spear. His unrivaled domineering aura was equally astonishing, and his terrifying energy shook the heavens and the earth. His eyes were as cold as the Zhuan ice of the North Sea, and his pitch. Black eyes were filled with intense killing intent, clearly intending to kill Kang Tian at this moment. This heavenly tribulation, Li Yuanba had thoroughly felt Kang Tian's powerful talent. And even though he didn't want to admit it, he had to admit that Kang Tian's talent was indeed going to surpass him. Therefore, he had to kill Kang Tian before he grew up otherwise he would have no chance. Even if you pass through the heavenly tribulation, you still cannot escape death today. Li Yuanba's icy cold eyes were permeated, with intense killing intent as he approached step by step, the long spear in his hand spewing out a blazing light. Kang Chon coldly watched him approach, a disdainful look appearing in his eyes as he faintly said, take out that treasure weapon, otherwise you don't have a single chance in front of me. Arrogant. Li Yuanba was furious at these words. The long spear in his hand transformed into a matchless spear on and instantly killed the sky. Terrifying energy completely erupted at this moment, forming a vast and matchless torrent rushing forth. Worthy of being one of the four emperors of the imperial capital, Li Yuanba's strength was indeed very powerful. Jin San Shao and Lei Yun were unable to compare with him. The one that was replicated by the heavenly tribulation a short while ago could not. Compared to this real Li Yuanba, after all, the one at that time was only at the fourth level of Jiden stage cultivation. While the cultivation of this real Li Yuanba had already reached the sixth level of Jiden stage, but likewise, the current Kang Chan also had a cultivation of the fifth layer of the Jiden stage and his strength had increased by several times. Boom! With a shocking explosion, Kang Chun leapt out with a single step and instantly appeared in front of Li Yuanba. He blasted his fist against the matchless spear, and the powerful energy sent out a shocking big explosion in the air. After the explosion, Kang Chun did not move at all, while Li Yuanba was sent flying out by Kang Chun's punch. Hiss! The crowd watching the battle all sucked in a mouthful of cool air. Kang Chion's strength could be so powerful that he repelled Li Yuanba with a single punch, and the terrifying Zhao Wuji was no better. Or, oh, Li Yuanba roared out in anger. He was shocked and angry in his heart. Kang Chion's strength was beyond his expectations. At this time, Kang Tian at the fifth level of the Jiden stage was no longer an object that he could oppress in the beginning. As I said, without taking out the Overlord gun, you have no room to fight back in front of me. Kang Chun once again stepped forward, as if he was strolling idly. His eyes were incomparably indifferent. The fist in his hand was natural, and each punch was filled with a powerful force. This was not an outburst of true essence, but Kang Chun's own physical strength. At this moment, Kang Chun's physical body had already reached a terrifying point. Just based on his physical body alone, it was enough to laugh at the young generation of the Great Tang Cultivation World. Boom! Li Yuanba fought back. He exerted his entire body's true essence. 
powerful energy swept over like the waves in the sea. The surging aura was so vast and powerful that it wanted to rush up to the nine heavens. However, Kang Chon just plain and simple punch will be Li Yuanda's full force of the blow crushed. That devastating general powerful force so that all the people watching the battle outside the field of fear and trembling. At this time, even a fool could see that Li Yuanba and Kang Chong were not at all at the same level. Under Kang Chong's fist, Li Yuanba did not have the slightest power to resist. What a terrifying youth!